To deliberate on the demands raised by stakeholders and residents of Oriade LCDA concerning the year 2024 budget, the chairman, Ramotalaya Kinola Hazan, has called on the management team for discussion and deliberation in a retreat. The event was well attended by head of departments, supervisors, councillors and key officials of the local government. Speaking during the procurement and budget retreat exercise, the chairman said the budget is aimed at improving the standard of living among residents of Oriade local council development area. She urged everyone to join hands to improve the internally generated revenue of the council. I hereby declare the year 2024 procurement retreat tag strategic procurement plan the budget retreat tag budget of realization open i wish you a fruitful deliberation thank you god bless you the technical session on procurement with the theme Strategic Procurement Plan, facilitated by Mr. Rogeshi Uludayo, gave insights on the benefits of procurement plan. This meeting is a meeting that we need to submit our needs. And at the end of the submission, we will see those areas where we need to aggregate. Eh? When we aggregate, what are we deriving from aggregation? Eh? We are trying to come up with economy. Eh? trying to come up with reduction of what? Of cost. We are trying to come up with our uh, uh, durability. That whatever we are buying should be what? Should be a team that has warranty. Let me let you know, a law, the procurement law emphasizes on warranty whenever you buy it. Eh? Don't just think you buy it and uh, one more food. No. The strategy word that is, that is added to this uh, year retreat. Be Participants commended the retreat. The LCDA is focused more on the issue of capital projects in terms of rehabilitations of roads, in terms of uh, constructions of buildings, schools, and some other things that you know, necessary amenities. So I, I want to believe with the teams of uh, the year 2024 budget, budget of realization, I want to believe we are going to realize what we actually projected for 2024. Government of Lagos State especially, they were trying to see that um, funds available are managed effectively and they were deployed for the appropriate um, programs and um, uh, issues concerning even the personnel of the, of, the, of, the, of the state civil service. And um, I can see that um, uh, recently the, uh, the Lagos State uh, Public Government Direct, uh, Director General he was able to give, he was able to uh, win an award, a global award concerning procurement process, and it was a what, a plus for Lagos State Government. We are well prepared, both on the intellectual side, the professional side, and what we need to now adopt is to probably tactfully balance it up with uh, the finance. You know, without finance, you cannot actually execute your project. And budget is a function of availability of funds. If the funds are not there, it will just remain a mirage. But now that we have gotten the concept on how to mash our uh, activity into realization of the desired budget or desired uh, I mean, project that we have for the people of Oriadi, we are good to go. Going by the economic recession, we have observed that the cost of construction and other projects and programs have seriously increased. And then um, we have to look in what to balance, you know, the, the economic reality. And um, I'm happy that all concerned are here today and we are doing what it takes to make sure we have a very reliable budget for 2024. The general expectation is that the year 2024 budget will meet the needs of the residents. They should please pay their levies 
so that they'll be able to enjoy the visitors of democracy. And they should make sure that the environment is clean. They should make sure that they, 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 they clear off the drainage in their frontage of their house and their shop. And they should stop building houses on top of the drainage. They should stop building houses on top of the drainage. They should stop blocking because all areas in Rada is waterlocked area. They should stop building houses on the walkways. Oh, she really.